Hello fellow Caribs and welcome it's me GD your favorite ship ship in anomaly here and today we are starting a completely new game as we play three out of ten from terrible posture games so there's two seasons out already they're both free on the epic game store so please do have a go of this when you do get a chance as well um so there's five episodes per that we're going to be doing well pretty much all of them if we can um not today but over the next i don't know how long how many weeks uh but uh you know what let's just begin shall we disclaimer we are at terrible posture games are very excited to introduce you to the ridiculous world of three out of ten while three out of ten is absurd by design this premiere episode contains depictions of protesting which some viewers may find upsetting given the highly important conversations happening in our society today viewers discretion is advised so welcome to shovel works daytime on the beach Hey, time on the beach. Look at them. Enjoy their novelties and their relative safety. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. I could be one of them. I could enjoy relative safety too. But I'm not. But I'm not. I'm me. They say nothing is more dangerous than a tiger shark. They call them the people killers, lake eaters, the terror of the open water. I call them. Surfing buddies. Uh. I don't know. I thought it was a cool announcement trailer. Yeah, it was something all right. But that wasn't a tiger shark. That was a great white. Yeah, I changed it to a tiger shark in the script. Everyone uses great whites. We need to stand out. Well, I'm not changing my art. You fix your script, Kevin. Tiger sharks oh. aren't even as dangerous as great whites. Oh, you can train them to run contraband, though. Wait, really? Wait, what? Uh, look, it's still a shark. That's the important thing. All right, circle up, everyone. As you all know, we announced surfing with sharks today. Reception has been wonderful. The internet loves it. That's totally not true, but it's good for morale to tell you that. Yes. Now, I know it's been a rough few weeks for you all. We faced hard deadlines, crashing builds, technical downturn. The desk behind him. Javier exploded too. Oh, okay, Don't that makes sense. Javier. His desk has been covered in blood all week. Look, I'm sure he's fine. He exploded. Also, this meeting isn't about Javier. That's actually what I wanted to talk to you all about. Javier. Huh? Yeah, a week is a long time without an animator, so I'm happy to introduce to you all Midge, our new animator. So Javier's not coming back. He That's exploded. Totally that. that bastard still <laughs> owes me ten bucks. Okay, look, everyone, it's company policy not to talk about Javier anymore. Midge is the new Javier. Everyone say hello. Hi, Midge. Hi. Hi. Uh, I thought this was for an interview. This is Shovelworks Studios, right? Midge here comes highly recommended. Anything Javier could do, <laughs> I'm sure she could handle. Just make her feel welcome. Any questions? Yeah, what do we do about all the people outside? People? Huh? What people? I don't know. A crowd of people just showed up a few minutes ago. God damn it, oh, what does this always happen to us? Well, don't make eye contact and maybe they'll go away. I don't know. Kevin, you deal with it. And make sure Midge is all set up. Back to work, everyone. Well, I guess it's been a few months. I wonder what they want this time. Last time, it was because our game didn't have a sewer level. Uh, yeah, I'm yeah. Not changing my mind on that one. Not every game needs a sewer level. Every game yeah. needs a sewer level. I'll see how good the noise canceling <laughs> is on my headphones. All right. Well, Midge, uh, I'm not sure what Jeb wants me to do with you. I'm not even on the art team. Just so you know, I wasn't kidding. I was told by the recruiter that this was literally supposed to be an interview. Well, we work quick. Some might say rush. Pylon, any ideas on how to handle the fans outside? Uh, bribery? Mm, can't afford that. They sure don't look like fans out there. Yeah, they look I mean, quite angry. They wouldn't keep coming by every few months if they weren't passionate about our games. Look, Midge, why don't you uh, go meet your coworkers while Pylon and I brainstorm? 
you'll probably be working a lot with Viper, so be sure to say hello to him. Oh, uh, all right. Right, so um, we've got to go and meet and greet everybody. Um, meet and greet um, everybody. So it's play the test to build, check out the old console. Come back once you've said hello to a few people. Okay. My name's Pylon. Did you know that the latest build is always hooked up to the TV? You can try it out any time. Okay. Look, I can't promise I'll remember your name, but that's okay. Is it? I've got a lot of thinking going on up here about <clears throat> boss things. <clears throat> Why don't you go say hi to some of your teammates? Okay. Hmm. Why is it all funky? What's this? Huh. I've never seen a game studio with a dumb waiter. Yeah, it might be useful. Why is there a ducky in the thing? Good look, rubber duck. Ever have an issue that you can't resolve? Try talking to a rubber duck about it. Okay. Hmm. Guess they really don't want anyone going through this door. I hear voices when I go towards the door. Big design ideas. An end? Huh. Okay. Get rid of angry fans, giveaways, team piece, t shirt, intern. Come out like that, yeah. Three out of ten. Huh. I wonder what this meter is for. Yeah, might be useful. I haven't got the key as well. Guy's desk. Seems to really like pale yellow green. Yeah, I can tell. What's with all those bottles up there? Oh, ketchup. Yeah, okay, let's go. I can do it. I can get five stars. Let's do this. I can actually move forward. That uh, that might have been helpful. Okay, 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 do this. Yay, did it. Five stars. Hmm. Check out the old console. Huh? That's designed. Is there under umbrella? Oh, hello. hello there. Are you one of the developers here? No, I'm Timothy 3000, automated office assistant. I'm here to help you with all your needs. Okay. Hi there. Hi, I'm Joan. I've been working in the industry since the 90s, but I've only been here a few years. I'm Midge. I've apparently been working here for 10 minutes. I really thought it would be harder to get this job. Oh, dear, no. You haven't read much about our studio, have you? Not really, mm -hmm. no. Well, you'll learn. We have a bit of a reputation. Oh. oh. Okay. This looks like a map of the studio. That's handy. Right, so Jeb, Dumbwaiter, Kevin, Pylon, Joan, now my desk. Bye, bye. 
meat and room. But I'm guessing this is now my death. This guy didn't really explode, did he? Didn't that actually happen? Yes, so. Who's the person I need to go and talk to? Baron von Bro, uh, blah blah. Yeah, it might be important. Hi, Midge. Welcome to the studio. First, don't listen to anything Kevin tells you. He's a lying, heartless bastard. Second, we don't oh. have the budget for a new computer, so you'll have to use Javier Station. I guess that makes sense. It's still covered in blood, but you can worry about that later. Oh, all right. Right, okay. Hey. I'm Ben. Uh, look, no offense. Uh, Midge, was it? I'm trying to get some stuff done. That's fair enough, both met everybody. Oh, yeah, we keep our foam dart guns in there. Okay. This looks like the audio room. They may be recording in there. That's right, it says recording. There's a note here. Warning, Sally is feisty today. Huh. Who's Sally? Who Sally is. Whoa, this thing needs to be cleaned. How many rubber hey, ducks here? Cool. Oh. Gaming device. It's been years since I saw one of these. Nay. Okay, in the future, humanity learned how to harness the power of the mut bossy particle. To siphon energy from it, you need to activate the hydroelectric gate. Whenever the particle passes by, pressing the big friendly button in front of you, activating the gate at the wrong time will get you fired. Oh, I get it. I got the star at least. Is everything here? This box of Hugbot cereal expired three years ago. Uh, then don't eat it. Oh, I'll start on the boat. Wait, I can rotate things? Okay. Right, let's talk to you can call me Viper. I'm okay. the best there is at what I do, and I don't suffer incompetent fools. Okay. Are you incompetent? No, no, no. no. I'm Midge, and no, I don't think so. I'll be the judge of that. Look, if you're gonna fill in Javier's shoes in animating my masterpieces, uh -huh. you need to prove to me you know what you're doing. Okay. A good pose is crucial to properly showing off my work. I have right. a lot of action figures, mostly from my favorite game, Sweaty Blood. Show oh. me you know how to make badass poses by posing them. Okay. So, got the body part, next pose, previous pose. Okay, I, I think this I've got this. Bloody Chuck. Look at all that detail. That's how you know it's a good design, okay? Chuck is the sturdy hero of the game. He keeps his pouches shut with Phillips head screws. Huh, sweet. He keeps books in all those pouches. He's a scholar warrior. That's important in season four. isn't important in character art looking cool is important look at me free 
great tip. Articulation is very important in character art. I did it. Nice. Easy enough. Right. Just with the mask. Okay. At least until the station break. Hey, you hear that Shovelworks Studios is making another game? Oh god, not again. Is this another turnstile jumper game? No, I don't think so. No one wants your crappy turnstile jumper game, Shovelworks. I never got to try it. Was it really that bad? Are you kidding me? It was the worst. Literally the worst game ever made. No, I take that back. Cannibal American Football 2018 was worse. Is no. that the one where you can drop famous cannibals to your actually played it that game is just double pledges yeah i mean winning a game just came down to whichever team made it out of the locker rooms with the most lead spilling cash i can't believe someone is letting them make another game looks like it's some surfing game it looks kind of simple but it's not terrible you wait fail brings you terrible if there's one thing you can rely on it's that you can't rely on shovel work studio okay fair enough Oh, a little bit. Okay. I think we could make good games if I wanted to. Just big ideas. Looks like this meeting room doesn't get used very often. Damn. People do still sound very angry out there. Hmm. Well, we've done what we did. the last animator oh have you uh, yeah right so should i be worried about what happened to him oh no spontaneous combustion just happens sometimes <laughs> animators just do that you know it's the stress can i have his chair what no that's going to be midge's chair i don't think people just explode yeah that is not not normal past, we need to think of a way to deal with those oh. people outside why should she get the good chair i've been here much longer can't you just go talk to them <laughs> Talking never solves anything. Oh, maybe we can camouflage the studio. Or hire a velociraptor. Look, I'm just gonna go ask them what they want. Take a clue of that. Wow, this is a big crowd. Where did you all come from? Oh, a developer. This is the New England chapter of the Global Internet Fandom Coalition. This is what we do. Okay. A mobile fan club. All right, nice. Shovelwork Studios has their own fan club. Of course not. We're a generic group. We go where we're needed. Today was slow, and Linda loves sharks. It's true. So you're fans of? <laughs> I like Linda. What? Yes, absolutely. At least today. Did you really think you could pass off a great white as a tiger shark? Great whites have pointy heads. I mean, seriously. Okay. Has the game industry lost all reason. Hey everyone, what do we want? <laughs> yes. Fix the shark. Oh, want to buy a t-shirt? That's 100% cotton. Ooh. Um, no, not really. <laughs> You're a loss. Look, okay. you think you can get away with everything. Well, you got a choice. Either fix that shark or cancel the game. <laughs> cancel the game? We can't do that. It's just starting to come together. Yeah, Maybe fair we enough. we could just fix the shark. No, it must be a tiger shark. Tigers are cool. Yeah, canceling things would totally compromise our vision. Pylon, hey. What? They're right. It's a great white, not a tiger shark. And it's a cool shirt. Okay, so tell me about this game. It's a nice oh, shirt. Intrigued. It's nice the shirt. You know your endless runner games, right? Those mobile mm -hmm. titles where you always race to the right and have yeah. to jump over things and, and yeah. try and last as long as you can. Yeah, yeah so it's terrible. like that. It's an endless runner, but the twist is. Yeah. Wait for it. Well, there's an end. That's it? You're making an endless runner with an end? I call it an endful runner. Or maybe just endy runner? Well, whatever. The just a runner then. Is ultimately who decides a new subgenre's name. We just have to make the game no one realized they wanted. I love making games no one wants. So, yeah, I'm not so sure I'm the best fit for this place. It seems a bit 
intense. Oh, you yeah. get used to it. Everyone here is great. With the exception of Viper. And all of the engineers. And the boss. Mm -hmm. And the tiger shark. Yeah, it's screw the tiger shark. Spontaneous combustion of animators. But yeah, can we stop making them explode? Also, look, we need you, Midge. This game, this is going to be a hit. But only if we have a good animator. That's why Javier was so important. Okay. What's in the fridge? Well, what's that, Sally? Free soda. Oh. Guys, they're getting restless out there. <clears throat> I don't think they're going to leave on their own this time. Right. How do you calm down a crowd of fans? Well, everyone gets angry when they're hungry. Could we try feeding them? There's granola in the kitchenette, but that's not going to go very far. I have a lot mm -hmm. of ketchup. We can make ketchup granola stew. Seriously? That's revolting. That's just not revolting. Salsa will give it body. Okay, okay. Granola, ketchup, and salsa. Does anyone know how to cook? Oh, I do. Does anyone except for Pylon know how to cook? I can do it, team. I can do it. Okay, look. Why don't both of you handle this? Wait. Uh, okay. Why are we doing this? Stack ingredients to build recipes. Move completed recipes to Pylon. Speed things up. If I want to. I'll hold speed up. Got it. So I can move Midge. Toggle stack selection. something with this Granola will make it chucky style Are things normally like this around here? Oh no. Nah. Some days get really weird. Show pylon. What's with the tentacles? Oh, that's just Sally. She's harmless. Ooh, do something with this. One more thing for the pot. Oh, 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 oh no, stay there. Take this. Hey, get back there. Ooh, do something with this. What's that path? Just so. Uh, right, I just need cereal. There we go. Excellent. If I do say so myself. Nice work, Suey nice. Shepage. Let it never be said that anyone goes hungry here at Shovelworks Studios. Well, he just made something disgusting. We present spicy granola stew. Why? Ah. Uh, oh, how does it taste? Yeah, I'm not tasting that. Oh, me neither. I think it's pretty good. And we can serve Ridgy potato chips on the side. That's a good idea. Everyone loves Ridgy potato chips. Okay, time to serve up some guests. I don't do this. Are you going to poison them? <laughs> Come on, it wasn't that bad. Okay, that, that was a terrible idea. <laughs> no, really. Adam, I'll chase him off. Or you could change the shark. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. What's going on? Code red. Meter's down to two out of ten. What happened? What made it drop? Hey, hey, hey. Where are the news? Terrible game studio tries to poison upset. Yeah. Yeah, they're not our fans. If we fix the shark, will you stop being mad? We'll always be mad. What? Why? Your game isn't as good as Witcher 3. 
That's fair enough. We're out of options. You don't mean what I think you mean, right? We have no choice. We need to ask the engineers for help. Mitch, quick! Go to the supply closet and get an intern! A what? An intern! We keep them in the supply closet. Francine has the key. Wait, what? Let's turn. Um, let's turn see. Can you tell Kevin to keep it down already? Uh, sure. Can you unlock the supply closet? I need to get something. Sure. Knock yourself out. Thanks. Okay. Give the intern. Best intern. Give the intern to the. Oh, it's one of these puzzle things. I hate this. Um. I can't wait to tell folks about my time as an intern. I'm really, really excited to be here. Your voice sounds very familiar. Right. I hope they feed you, intern. But I do it with less. Let's, um, Yeah, there you go. All five. Happy with that now. The intern. Good work, Midge. Oh, hello, mentors. Uh, hi there, intern. I'm Midge. Why do we need them again? To convince the lead engineer to help us. The programming department only communicates by handwritten requests delivered via dumbwaiter with an offering. Do I get to work on the game now? Uh, sure. Look, Midge, we need to get them to uh. the dumbwaiter. Right. Okay. A dumbwaiter. Do you really think the lead engineer can talk some sense into the crowd? Oh, no, no, no. That's not safe. No one is allowed to talk to the engineers here. I think Don Farrell! But the lead engineer has other means to solve our problems. You'll see. Or you could just change the shark. What? You could just change the shark. Reasonable, Midge. Mayday, Mayday, we got company! That's the last time you poison anyone with your food or your game. If you won't fix the shark, we will. Ow! Intense to dumb way through. Keep intense safe. Hit enemy to stun. We need to keep the intern away from the crowd. Toss them to me if they get close. Or me. Throw the crate. Oh, oh, me. Ooh. I'm on it. Ooh. Hey, hey, don't attack me. I'm wearing your shirt, see? Quick, over here. So many of them. Toss the crate to me. Over here. Toss the crate to me. Oh, and a bad, big bad one. Fix your game, and this will all be over, developers. Oh no, 
I wasn't expecting a boss fight. Ow. Ow. Yipe. He's enraged. That makes him immune to pain. <laughs> Yay, we did it. Send him down, Pylon. The door! It's not gonna hold! What do we do? Hold on. Give them time. The lead engineer will do something. Just wait. What's your processing? Come on, do something. <coughs> no processing. Eh? Uh, eh? Uh? do that that's chaser's defining trait how dare they who do they think they are all chapters mobilized this is a code foxtrot condition omega pack it up folks let's go racer chase needs us we will avenge this travesty don't they know how important unibrows are okay they're heading out <sighs> see the elite engineer always finds a way nope Hey, hey, someone leaked news about the new Razor Chase movie. Ah, the old distraction trick. Clever. The lead engineer did that? The oh. lead engineer works in mysterious ways. Oh my god, what happened to him? Quick, call for help. It's fine. They just have a lot of bones down there. How is that fine? How is any of this fine? We send one whenever we need something from the engineers. Schools just keep sending them to us. We're low right now, but we'll get another shipment eventually. Buy a poker night. We use them as chips. Look, I could see okay. past the thing with the animator and your fan club and the thing growing in the kitchen, and even the fact that this is apparently the worst game studio in existence. But this is too much. This is where I check out. I'm out of here. Midge, wait. Wait a sec. What? See that counter up there? Yeah, what about it? That's tied to an algorithm that takes into account focus testing, mock reviews, A-B results, and a hundred other factors in order to create a predictor of our expected score. It says three out of ten. That's terrible. It is. We've never had any of our games score above three out of ten. But not anymore. Not with this project. This project is different. I thought review scores didn't matter anymore. They matter to the people I went to high school with. Okay. I will show them. This game will be a hit. Ugh. But it needs a good animator to tie it all together, Midge. Well, we'll have to find someone else. Midge, just wait. So, just say it. This is all the tiger shark's fault. Wait, is really? Well, why don't we just change the shark? Um. That's what she was saying. Look, I can't do this. These people are terrifying. There's something growing in the refrigerator, and there is some sort of ritual involving interns, and who knows what's going on with their basement. You know that's not what we want to hear, Miss Potter. You had a role, and we had an agreement. Yeah, well, that agreement didn't mention <sighs> all the crap going on in there. Your job was a simple one. What? To 
Director will be disappointed, but not surprised. What does that mean? We've been assembling a file on you, Miss Potter. Your interests go far beyond animation. Hmm? Some of those extracurricular activities you partake in, those come with long prison sentences. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm sure. Our file is quite interesting. Photos, videos, documents. Your local police department would find it fascinating. Is this blackmail? This is a friendly warning. You know what we're capable of. This is bigger than you and me, Miss Potter. Go join them. Gain their trust. Mm -hmm. Work with them. But remember, they must never make a good game. They don't need me for that. I don't think you understand. This is the most important job you've ever had. If they make a good game, it will be the end of everything. Wait, what? Here we go. And our next episode will be... Hey, look, I'm at the top. Nice person. 31 out of 34. Where did I miss them? I rabbit beat everyone else. That's, that's what I care about. <laughs> but um, yeah, that is the first episode of 3 out of 10. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Of course, please like comment and subscribe to us here at Craig Your Game and we will be back next time for more randomness. As always, I am GD, your favourite shapeshifting anomaly and till then to be continued. Bye everyone.